Hello and welcome once again to the Thrifty Collector. I had somebody send me a message if I actually had a Vita Blue or Gene Tennis card signed in their A's uniform. This is one that I just got back. Uh, I had picked the, cup, the card up back in December when I went to that uh, card show in Alabama and uh, picked this up with a bunch of other ones. And uh, Vita Blue and Gene Tennis were both great players. They were part of that early 70s dynasty of the A's. A lot of people forget the A's won more World Series in the 70s than any of the other teams, including the Reds and the Yankees. Uh, by about the mid-70s, they were really starting to uh, go down. They had lost a lot of the great players. Um, Reggie Jackson was probably the first one to go, and then they lost Jim Catfish Hunter. Vita Blue eventually left. Tennis uh, left. Sal Bando, uh, Ray Fossey who uh, was still recovering from his injuries from Pete Rose. Uh, but this is, uh, this is one of my favorite cards. Uh, has both of these great A's legends and, as their rookies, uh, Vita Blue and Gene Tennis. Uh, when I decided to get this, uh, Vita Blue and Gene Tennis both signed via Past Pros, and I believe it's pastpros.com. I uh, sent them off. I think it was about $18 to get Vita Blue signed. Gene Tennis was about $20 possibly to get this card signed. So uh, you can get both of these done for about $40. If you're an A's fan, this is one of the terrific cards because these guys really were part of the backbone of those uh, great A's teams in the uh, early and mid-70s. So just wanted to put this out there, show it to you. You can get it done uh, via Pass Pro. It's going to cost you a few bucks. It was probably about $40 altogether. But I think if you look at the significances of baseball history, this is really a great card to have. So thanks for checking it out. Hope you enjoyed it. If you got this card, get it done. Have a great one and stay thrifty.